Hello guys welcome back to show of our celebrity news and updates where we bring you the right update and all of what you will like to know. If you are new here or if at all you are just passing by for the first time, please take some minutes of your time to subscribe, like, comment and hit the notification button so that you will not miss in any of my uploads. Second seat, Igor Zwitek defeated world number one Arina Sabalenka 6-3, 6-2 on Sunday to advance to the WTA finals title match where she will face unbeaten Jessica Pegula. By defeating the current Australian Open champion, Zwitek deprived Sabalenka of the victory that would have given the 25-year-old Belarusian first place at the end of the year. Instead, the reigning French Open champion Zwitek of Poland can secure the world number one spot for the second year in a row at the end of the year by defeating the American Pegula in the championship match on Monday. I feel like there is still a long way to go because I think tomorrow's game will be the most difficult, said Zwitek. We can talk about it tomorrow after the game. I just keep doing what I'm doing. Sabalenka overtook Zwitek at the top of the table two months ago, but will only keep it if Pegula wins. On Saturday, Pegula defeated her compatriot Coco Gauff 6 2, 6 1 in an hour, and moved into the championship game of the WTA finals. This extended her winning streak to nine games. Zwitek has a 5 3 lead over Pegula in the competition but the American has won two of three games this year. The United Cup and the August semi-finals on hard courts in Montreal. Zwitek defeated Pegula in this year's final in Doha. I can't give you the keys for tomorrow, said Zwitek. I will work on it. The final was reported on Monday at the top of the table. Here is the program of the week on the outdoor courts in Cancun, Mexico, in particular Zwitek and Sabalenka after three games before the semi-finals that same evening. When play resumed on Sunday, Zwitek was leading 2-1 on serve, and the pole only recovered after the only break of the first set. Zwitek broke at the start of the second set, and broke again with an overhead shot at 5-2, then held serve and won on her first match point on a service winner. Sabalenka defeated Zwitek in the semi-finals of last year's WTA finals, and won their two previous meetings this year. Both on clay. Thank you for watching to the end, guys. If you have something to tell us about this video, leave your comment on the comment section below. Your comments matters a lot. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and share. See you next time.